Hey everyone, Jacob here with North Star Hunting. So in this next uh, few videos I got coming out, basically what we're gonna do is a three part video and what it is, it's covering a trip that Ryan Graves, Hunter Higgins and myself all took out to uh, South Dakota and uh, had some, some really good luck, seen a ton of deer uh, going after some big whitetails and, and mealies. So anyways, just kind of wanted to give you a heads up here. There's gonna be three parts to this. Um, and there's a ton of deer, ton of action. So get ready and check it out. And, oh, and thanks for watching. Loaded up, getting ready to go. Yeah, is it seven? Yeah. Seven thirteen. Ice castle. Is packed gear everywhere. Got the four wheeler, the quiet cat, all the gear. Hunter's ready to roll. You ready? Oh, yeah. I'm ready to roll. Trying to. It's cold. It's like 28 degrees out right now. So, up in just north of St. Cloud, Minnesota, and heading out to West South Dakota. So stay tuned, this is gonna be awesome. You guys ready? Let's roll. Let's roll. Rover is beautiful bean footage. <laughs> Got off the main highway, guys, out in South Dakota here. Getting ready to uh, go out, do a little scouting, check out some deer out here. Uh, weather's been pretty decent. Decent cold front came through, and it's got these deer up on their feet, so we're pretty jacked, excited. Yep, I'm pumped. We got Hunter back here, myself, and uh, yeah. First time in South Dakota for, for myself and the hunter. Well, first time out here mule deer hunting, I should say, or whitetail, whatever we end up getting. One right there. We got there. Got some oh, steaks. Yeah. Night what do you one. think, buddy? That's pretty good. All right, so we got some steak, got a couple of ribeyes, and we got some mushrooms and onions. So how was tonight? Dude, it was awesome. We saw like I want to say around 35 deer, two possible shooters right off the bat. And then uh, saw a nice little mule deer doe on the way back to camp. So. It's actually two, wasn't it? Yeah. It was two. Yep, it was two. Yeah. But, yeah, man, it's looking good. Night one, day one tomorrow, technically, but night one here at camp. We spotted a lot of awesome deer. We're already rock and roll, aren't we? 
Yep. All right, let's do it. So you can hear them in the background and they have not stopped mooing for the longest time. 150 head, kind of funny. And you can hear it pretty plain as day inside uh, the ice castle. I mean, it's not terrible, but it's, it's bad enough that um, maybe I'll be singing us lullabies, I guess, tonight. Tuesday morning, we're gonna go out. We're gonna scout a section of the property we haven't uh, had a chance to scout yet. Um, did some scouting on one side yesterday, saw a lot of deer, so it looks good, but we really wanna get some intel on the other side of the property so we can um, kind of make a game plan for the rest of the week. But yesterday was pretty dang good, wasn't it? It was, it was awesome. I was not expecting to see that many deer. Yeah, we saw- A couple of shooters. A couple shooters. How many deer do you think we saw, Hunter? Had to be there. Yeah. yeah. At least forty or fifty. A couple nice ones. I <laughs> I struggled a little bit trying to get them on with the spotting scope, but yeah. They're a long ways away because they're out in the fields and we're up on top of the hill. But that's kind of the plan this morning. They'll kind of look from afar, scout it, and go after it, right? Yeah, absolutely. I think this evening we might try to get out and sit somewhere, but we'll see. See how it goes. Okay, so doing a little spotting right now. Um, I just went to go grab my spotting scope and put it on, and it's got a jingle jangle to it. Um, yesterday when we were spotting, it fell off the tripod probably a couple feet off the ground, and I'm guessing with the ground being so hard, it probably just knocked something loose in it because it's... Got that jingle jangle and it ain't working, so which really sucks. Is what it is. We're gonna just concentrate on trying to see what else we can see out here and go from there. I mean, not much you can do now, so hopefully, Vortex is willing to cover it. shooter bucks so far so it's been a really good morning I'm perched up on top of a hill overlooking this 
low area down here, kind of by the river bottom. And where the deer actually were coming out, I, I didn't know that that's, I, I figured they'd be coming out in the field way down there, but they're not. They're crossing right across this hilly prairie area, you know, kind of towards the bottom left. But um, been a great morning, seen a lot of deer. Um, so far, I've probably seen about somewhere around like 20, 25 deer so far. So pretty cool to see this in beautiful country out here. And in front of me is probably another 15 deer or so. Lots and lots and lots of deer out here. But yeah, super excited. Uh, really looking forward to getting out this, this evening. Uh, just seeing that just tells me that's probably right down here is probably where I'm going to go. I'm going to just stand back and hear that that uh, you can hunt. So, there's definitely deer around. It's really good. So this is the most I've seen so far as far as shooter bucks. Which is really cool. Well, I guess I'm telling you, this has been probably the most spectacular morning I've ever had sitting here and watching these bucks come through one after another after another. A lot, a lot of nice bucks. And they're all going down in this corner back over here. So, I really like to take a look at that today. I know there's a stand back in there, um, but if this is where they're they're crossing right in front of me, and there's so many deer that cross right up here. And if you can get a stand in there or something in there to get these deer um, when they're coming through, man, that could be good. That could be really good. So we'll uh, I'll have to take a look at it and see what we can get figured out. All right, guys, well, it's about 1.30 right now. And uh, we are headed back out to get ready to hunt the afternoon and evening. It's actually going to be our first hunt down here in South Dakota for this week. And this morning we did some spotting, saw a lot, a lot of deer, a lot of nice bucks. And, you know, I feel like our opportunity is going to be really good. Where we're, where we're going, we saw quite a few decent bucks this morning. A couple yeah. of shooters for sure. So. Yeah, there was quite a few shooters I saw. Some of them are tough to tell, but they're a little ways away, but you can see a lot of rack there. Yeah. And I like a lot of rack, so. <laughs> Man, these deer are all over. <laughs> I'll tell you, we're just driving down the road and one just jumps out in front of us. So Tuesday, October 18th, about two o'clock, light wind, it's kind of variable. We're in South Dakota, I'm here with Ryan and Hunter. And we're gonna go out and hopefully put down a nice big buck. Um, we actually have seen uh, quite a few bucks out in this area here. So um, if you look behind me, right over here is where, in this area, is where Ryan and Hunter are gonna go. And then I'm taking my bike um, back up this way to where I saw a bunch of nice bucks come in yesterday, or this morning, sorry. And uh, we'll see if uh, we can't, can't stick something. So, you ready to go, guys? Heck yeah. All right, see we're gonna go at it. See what we can do. All right, guys, so, it's uh, quarter to five here. Just had one small buck come 
right behind the door. Where we talked to him on camera just because of what it was about. Here though, I walked right through that opening where I was in our deal this morning. And so I don't really hoping that any other deer that are coming through they're not just passing down back behind me. Because that would really suck. All right, guys. So that uh, that evening ended seeing all those deer, all those bucks. I mean, there was a ton. Um, Ryan and Hunter really didn't see much at all. Basically, one that what ended up happening there was um, they had all these turkeys, and then cows came in, and so they ended up seeing a uh, another um, uh, nice buck. It looked like I guess that was a little bit further down. They were going to try to put the sneak on it, and never ended up seeing it. So. But anyways, it was a great first evening hunt, awesome morning scouting. Um, so stay tuned for the next video and uh, we have a lot more action to come. Thanks for watching.